Oh, hello! I realized that I never actually made this video that I planned on making like seven months ago. And this is to show off all my fancy Arcanine Shaky Cam cards. As far as I know, this is every single version of every unique Arcanine card, not counting, you know, like Japanese versions, unless it's Japanese only, in which I had to get it, and that is the case in one of them. So, let's go on this journey of my ridiculous love for this Pokemon that I loved since I was a kid. Hey, look, it's my hand. Here's the first one. It's, oh, first edition, Arcanine, base set, shadowless and whatnot. First editions are always shadowless. Fun times. Next. Regular shadowless. Ooh, non-first edition. It looks exactly the same. You're going to see that. There's a lot of these base Arcanines. Here's the shadow. See, it has like a shadow on the corner. That means it's a shadow base set Arcanine. Lots of base set Arcanines. And oh my goodness, it's base set 2. I remember it was like, base set 2 sucked, man. I got a Charizard base set 2 and it just didn't feel the same. Nobody liked base set 2. Is that stupid 2? What's next? Oh, it's this thing from the Legendary Collection that I didn't even know existed. It's a reverse holofoil. I guess one of the first. Look at those sparkly fucking... Fireworks, I guess. That's not the only version. Oh, cause look, there's a regular Legendary Collection. Why did they re-release this same card? Oh, <laughs> hello, kitty. Yes, that's an Arcanine. That's Tyson Kid. Or Tyson Kitty. Yes, I, I have no clue what Legendary Collection is. I've never even heard of it, but apparently it came out and they had a nice shiny holophoto. This is the Japanese one. Oh, this came in like a Squirtle. What? No. Would you want it? No, too bad. I'm doing a video, kitty. A Squirtle, like, intro deck. And it was Japanese only. It says Windy. Because that's his Japanese name. Now for the hardest cards it took me to get. Another version of it with a stupid e-reader gimmick. This was a first edition. I didn't even know there were... What are you doing, kitty? Leave my cards alone. First edition version of this stupid card. And then the non-first edition was actually the last card I got. Non-first edition. Somehow harder to find than the actual first edition version of that. I think those were like a web only. You got them on... Like you ordered them online or something. It was called like Pokemon Web... My cat is very interested in what I'm doing. Here's the Black Star promo. I remember these when I was a kid. Pretty sweet. He looks very fierce. He looks like a big dog. And no, it just happens to be a coincidence that Arcanine is a big dog and I am the big dog. Moving on. Blaine's Arcanine. First edition. Blaine. That old bastard with his quizzes. and I remember when like the gyms first came out. Like... Everyone on the street got the Japanese versions of them at, like, a flea market and everything. Yes, okay, fine, my cat wants me to move on. All right, all right, relax. Okay, here we go. And here's the non-first edition, because I'm that, like, nitpicky. When I say I want to get every version of every card, that includes first editions being a variant. All right. So that's why I had to get, like, the Japanese one non-first edition, too. Ooh, Light Arcanine. I don't remember this one. I remember, like, the dark Pokemon, but this is a light Arcanine. It looks fluffy. First edition. Non-first edition, I guess, basic, base standard. I don't even know what the hell. I'm not that into cards. I don't know the terminology. Here we have this one. I think it's, like, Aquapolis. This is the shiny one. Or the hol- I called them holographics when I was a kid. Apparently they're holofoils. That doesn't sound as cool. Here's a reverse holofoil version. Because every card in existence needs a reverse holofoil. Made this collection a lot un more annoying to get. And then the regular boring version of the Aquapolis Arcanine. I think, like, this one has a different e-reader gimmick than the other ones. They have, like, lines on them or something. I never used an e-reader. Just another gimmick that... I didn't care about it as a kid. Here's another one with the e-reader. This is Sky Ridge. This is the regular holofoil. 
As far as I know, I have every card here. Like, like online, there was a thing like a reverse holofoil, holofoil sky ridge, which I don't think exists. But they listed it as they had it, and not in stock. Here's the reverse holofoil sky ridge Arcanine. Look at all these big dogs. My cat left, so I can get through this quicker. Here is the normal sky ridge Arcanine. Because there needs to be seven versions of every card. Oh, this one. This is. EX Sandstorm, I think. Reverse Holofoil, which means, you know, there's got to be a normal version of it. Maybe I should have done this in reverse order. Do the normal first, and then the reverse Holofoil to be a bigger surprise. What's next? Oh, this is apparently a reverse Holofoil for some reason. It's from EX Fire Red Leaf Green. Ooh. But it's like, how is that reverse Holofoil? Because of the Pokeball? Fuck off. Yeah, if your kid's watching this, I use the word fuck. Here's the normal version. The regular boring old version. But Oh, that's not it. Because here's one that's normal, but has a little mining on the bottom. And that technically counts as a different variant to the big dog. And so I had to get it. This is Arcanine EX. It's very shiny and nice and expensive. Surprisingly, there's only one kind of these. Uh, or maybe there isn't. Maybe there is a reverse holofoil version of this and I don't have it. But I would doubt it. Oh, this is like the cutest Arcanine card. Probably one of my favorite arts. I don't remember which one this is from. I think Secret Wonders, actually. I used to know these off the top of my head back when I bought them all. Secret Wonders, reverse holofoil, the cutest Arcanine. And then... Non-foil. Fucking strong, though. Look at that. 120 Inferno Onrush. Back in the day, like, Charizard doing 100 damage or whatever was, like, a big deal. Oh, let me use my other hand now. This is... This is an angry Arcanine. It's the... Holofoil version. Let me look it up. Because I'm a son of a bitch. And I gotta cheat. Ah, yes. Supreme Victor. Hello, kitty. What have you brought me? What have you brought me? A toy. Great. Okay, thanks. Go get it. Yes, this is Rising Rivals Arcanine. Oh, my hand is in the way. This is great production quality, just like Jeremax. Rising Rivals Arcanine Holofoil, which means this should be... Oh, wait, never mind. There's a reverse holofoil. Yes, uh... I actually don't think there's a normal non-foil version of this, so we move on to this fucking card. Which has like a million versions. Here's the... I think this is a... Yeah, that's the holofoil version of the Arcanine Galactic, or Arcanine G. He's a real G, that big dog. That big dog's a G, homie. And this is the reverse... Actually, no, this is the cross-stitch pattern gimmick one. Yes, I know, kitty. And has like a Pokeball on the inside, but the reverse holofoil is all like diagonal and shit. Like a cross-stitch pattern. Here, you want this toy? Go get it. Here is the normal reverse holofoil. It doesn't have a fancy cross-stitch pattern. So it technically counts as a different one. I think the cross-stitch was given out at like a championships or something. And there was a normal version, which was really hard to find for some reason. You would think this would be the easiest one to find. But no. I got sent the wrong ones like twice trying to get that normal version. Ooh, look at this. This comes from like the same galactic set, I think. It says Supreme Victor, so I'll go with it. Arcanine G. Except this is the regular, kind of derpy looking Arcanine, reverse holofoil. And non foil. He's got overrun combustion. That sounds like a poop joke. Here's the Arcanine Heart Gold Soul Silver. He's got like a Firestone, so he just evolved. By God, this is the holofoil. I don't know if you can tell. But it's a holofoil. Not a particular shiny one. Look at that mess I'm making. Here's the reverse foil, because every card needs a reverse foil. He's got sharp fangs. And then this, which is a non-foil version, which was came in like a starter pack thing. So... The non-foil version was the rarer version, unless he didn't get the starter pack. But yeah, this was like a starter pack exclusive, is what I mean. Alright. 
Okay, this is where it gets stupid. Here is, like, a promo card for the next Destiny's Black and White expansion. It's Holofoil. But there's also, oh, look at that, Staff. They made a different one for the staff in charge of these promo events. <laughs> because they need to make my life really complicated by getting every variant. Here's the normal promo card you got by going to these, like, I don't even know what they called. I just call them an event. All foil has, like, the next destinies right next to it. Here is the reverse hollow foil because, as we said, every card needs one. But this one has, like, flames in it. I guess that was a new thing they started doing. I don't know. This was like four years ago when this card came out. It's pretty sweet. Arcanine looks like he's frolicking. And this one is the normal boring version. Oh, yeah. And then this one has the cool reverse hollow full of flame things. This is... This and the one I just showed were from Next Destinies. There were two Arcanines in Next Destinies for some reason. This is like the shitty Arcanine, I think, and the other one was the cool Arcanine. Here's the reverse foil. And then finally, worst for last, Mr. Irrelevant, the boring, shitty Arcanine from Next Destinies. There's a new Arcanine out in like an Ambor Togekiss EX thing in Japan, but I'm just waiting for it to come out in English, because it's eventually going to come out in English, and I don't want to start collecting Japanese cards either. So, that was something I've been planning on doing for, like, all year and finally got around to doing. You saw my kitty butting in, and it was quite cute and adorable, much like the big dog Arcanine. Thanks for watching. Buh bye bye The big dog loves you.